the core of the rocket oven is the same as the core of a J-tube style rocket mass heater, a super insulated wood feed, burn tunnel, and heat riser. This pushes the temperatures over 1500 degrees Fahrenheit, which burns the smoke and creosote completely. So now the smoke and creosote are bonus fuels. We can now heat the oven with less fuel and the exhaust will be mostly steam and carbon dioxide. The white oven area is a simple metal container which conducts heat from the exhaust into the area where the food cooks. So the exhaust never touches the food and the fire never touches the metal of the inner oven. The outside of the rocket oven is insulated to force the heat exchange with the inner chamber rather than ambient air. The heat is extracted from the hot gases leaving behind cooler gases. The warmer gases rise to the top of the outer chamber, thus forcing the cooler gases to the bottom. The vertical exhaust at the back of the oven is warmer than ambient air, so a thermosiphon is created, pulling the cooler gases out to preheat the oven, prime the riser with a bit of fire right under the riser. Then, Start the full fire with a lot of small sticks, which will burn fast and hot. The rocket oven should heat up faster than any other oven. Put your pizza in. Put bigger wood in the feed. Smaller wood makes for a hotter oven. Check the temperature every 5 to 10 minutes. As you get more skilled at using the rocket oven, you won't need to check the temperature as often. If you like this sort of thing, Come on out to the forums at permies.com, where we talk about rocket ovens, homesteading, and permaculture all the time. Mm -hmm.